A fighting ship isn't just a hunk of steel, but a symbiosis of crewmen and material. The finest aircraft carrier is one that's both well-suited to its missions and handled with skill and daring do when and where it matters most. They remain a very potent means of power projection, but they are also very expensive and complicated systems to effectively operate. Some countries around the world possess aircraft carriers with powerful air wings, but others are more of a joke than anything serious. So let's take a look at the world's best aircraft carriers. Cavour, Italy. The flagship of the Italian Navy, Cavour aircraft carrier has a full load displacement of 30,000 tons and features several defense systems such as short range defense systems, guns, and decoy launchers. With a 760 feet by 113 feet flight deck, Gabor is capable of accommodating up to 20 aircraft, including AV-8B Harrier and JSF, as well as EH-101, AV-212, NH-90, and SH-3D helicopters. The 800 feet long aircraft carrier with a beam of 130 feet can also hold up to 24 main battle tanks. Its maximum speed of 16 knots, achieved with help of six diesel generators. INS Vikrant, India. INS Vikrant is an indigenous aircraft carrier that is the first aircraft carrier conceptualized and constructed in India. The construction happened in the Cochin Shipyard Limited. The ship has completed the sea trials and will be commissioned in the coming months. The total project cost was approximately 3.1 billion US dollars. The loaded displacement of the ship is around 45,000 tons, and the ship measures 860 feet in length and 193 feet in width. Even though INS Vikramaditya is bigger in dimensions, INS Vikran can carry a maximum of 40 aircraft on its deck and is technologically more advanced than INS Vikramaditya. Charles de Gaulle, France. The first French nuclear-powered surface ship, Charles de Gaulle, is one of the most important flight carriers of France and has been in service since 2001. The ship, which has a total displacement of 36,000 tons with a 780 by 103 by 27.8 feet structure, is the only nuclear-powered carrier in service with the navies other than the U.S. Navy. With a displacement of 42,500 tons, the battleship is capable of carrying up to 40 fixed-wing aircraft and helicopters including the Raphael M, E2C Hawkeye, Super A Tendered, EC725 Caracal, AS532 Cougar, and SA365 Dolphin. The aircraft carrier can attain a maximum speed of 27 knots and it has been provided with two K17 reactors for propulsion. Its design has been made keeping in mind the need for a battleship to show versatility and stealth. Known for its multi-role, the ship is highly combat-friendly, with both assaulting and carrying roles. Kuznetsov, Russia Russia's Kuznetsov-class aircraft carrier is one of the best aircraft carriers currently in service. Currently serving as the flagship of the Russian Navy, the 1,000-foot-long Admiral Kuznetsov aircraft carrier with a beam of 236 feet has a hull load displacement of 58,500 tons with its multi-role capacity. This heavily armed ship has the potential to serve as an aircraft carrier besides being laced with armaments that make it deadly enough. With its 15,800 square foot flight deck facility, it can carry up to 33 fixed wing aircraft and 12 helicopters. The aircraft carrier is capable of accommodating Su-33, MiG-29K and Su-25 UTG UBP STOVL fighters and KA-27S, KA-27LD-32 as well as KA-27PLO helicopters. Admiral Kuznetsov can also house 1,960 ships company, 626 air groups, and 40 flagstaffs abroad. Queen Elizabeth Class, United Kingdom. The largest aircraft carriers of the UK Royal Navy are the third largest aircraft carriers in the world. The biggest warships ever built for the British Navy. 
The Queen Elizabeth-class aircraft carriers are also the second largest non-U.S. Navy warships after Japan's Yamato-class battleships. Among the Royal Navy's two Queen Elizabeth-class aircraft carriers, HMS Queen Elizabeth was commissioned in December 2017, while HMS Prince of Wales was launched in December 2017 and is commissioned in December 2019. Both the vessels have a displacement of around 65,000 tons and measure 920 feet in length. The vessels can embark on up to 40 rotary and fixed-wing aircraft. They can embark 36 F-35B and four Marlin helicopters. Featuring the latest technology and automated systems aboard, these vessels only require a crew of 679 for a combat operation. Improved Nimitz Class, USA a total of 10 of these supercarriers were built, including three Nimitz-class ships and seven improved Nimitz-class ships. These have been the largest warships built and in service. With a full load displacement of 97,000 tons, these 1,100 feet long aircraft carriers have a 4.5 acre flight deck capable of carrying over 60 aircraft. These nuclear powered aircraft carriers can carry about 80 fixed wing aircraft and helicopters. These ships operate F-A-18 EF Super Hornets multi-role fighters, F-A-18 C Hornets ground attack aircraft, E-2C Hawkeye early warning aircraft, C-2 Greyhound transport aircraft, and various helicopters for utility, transport, and anti-submarine warfare operations. These supercarriers have automated self-defense systems against anti-ship cruise missiles by integrating and co-coordinating the ship's weapon and electronic warfare systems. In the forthcoming decades, all of these vessels are due to be replaced by the new Ford class aircraft carriers. Ford class, USA. The Ford class is a successor to the Nimitz class. The first carrier in its class, USS Gerald R. Ford, was commissioned in May 2017 and the four remaining announced vessels of this class are under construction. These will replace the Nimitz and improved Nimitz-class warships. The Ford-class aircraft carriers will be the mainstay of the U.S. Navy's power projection throughout the 21st century. Hull design of the Ford-class is similar to that of the Nimitz-class. The new aircraft carriers have a smaller, redesigned, and more stealthy island. The new aircraft carriers have the same displacement as the previous Nimitz-class, but are fitted with more automated and efficient systems. The Gerald R. Ford is 1,100 feet long with a beam of 2,500 feet. They feature a full load displacement of 10,000 tons and its 255 feet wide flight deck features an electromagnetic aircraft launch system as well as advanced arresting gear. USS Gerald R. Ford is capable of accommodating a total of 4,539 personnel and carrying over 75 aircraft. These include F-35BC, and FA-18EF Super Hornet multi-role fighters, EA-18G Growler electronic warfare aircraft, E-2D Advanced Hawkeye early warning aircraft, MH-60R and MH-60S naval helicopters. Defensive weapons of the Ford class include two launchers with 16 evolved Sea Sparrow missiles, ESSM each. These missiles are used against incoming high-speed maneuvering anti-ship missiles, it also has two launchers with 21 rolling airframe missiles, RAM, that are also used against anti-ship missiles at close range. Also, there are four 20mm phalanx close-in weapon systems. What do you think about these aircraft carriers? Which do you like most? Write your opinion in the comments below. Also, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications to always stay in touch. See you soon.